could you touch upon the Lightning Network and Rootstock and a little bit? All right. Since we actually have um, two people from the Lightning Network company in this room, raise your hands so that so the people at least two, right? So, roast beef right here, and Elizabeth somewhere in the back there. I don't know if you have anybody else from your team who I don't know, but at least two people. First of all, they know the real answer, so maybe they'll volunteer to answer questions later on a one-on-one -on -one basis. I'm going to volunteer them now. If you want a uh, completely wrong answer, um, based on the low information I've been able to cobble together in my limited understanding, here goes. Um, Lightning Network is an overlay layer two network. What's important about it is it uses actual Bitcoin transactions, right, to create promises that can be redeemed on the Bitcoin network in the future, settled, or can be forwarded and extended both in time and across multiple participants in such a way that allow you to encompass a much greater volume of transactions, much more fine-grained in time and amount. So you can do millions of participants, millions of transactions, milliseconds apart for a few satoshis, and still make it work and only settle the small subset, the final reconciliation. Um, it's an astonishing technology. It's an incredible invention. It is Bitcoin. It's Bitcoin layer two. And, but it's also Ethereum layer two, or any other blockchain that supports the basic multi-signature, time lock transactions, and some basic scripting capabilities. Every clone of Bitcoin can do it. What it does is it adds a dimension of processing that will blow away everything we've ever seen before. Imagine streaming your salary, not every two weeks, but every minute. Why not get paid every minute? Incrementally. Streaming money is the new concept. And it changes everything, really. That's the best I could do. Thank you. <laughs> Feel free to correct me afterwards on everything I got wrong. I'm sure I got a few things. All right. Huh? Um, yeah, Rootstock is still a uh, thank you. Rootstock is anyone from Rootstock here? Are you with Rootstock? No. <laughs> All right. I can get this one even more wrong. Um, Rootstock is um, an attempt to implement something that looks very similar to the Ethereum virtual machine on top of Bitcoin. That's as best I can do right now. Um, hasn't been implemented yet. Partly because it depends on a couple of underlying technologies. It, it needs segregated witness. It needs some new scripting opcodes uh, and the ability to soft fork upgrade some of the scripting language. Um, we'll see. Very interesting. <laughs>